Hello everybody, this is Greasy Spoon, and I am David, and today on the uh, video, we will be making a uh, eight layer dip. Um, if you make this dip, you can make it for your, uh, for Super Bowl parties, tailgate parties, any kind of party. Um, but if you make this dip, everybody's going to love it. So, you have to try it. Um, so let's get it started. All right, to start this recipe. You will be starting out with two pounds of ground meat. And you're going to get that browned up like you're making tacos. Alright, so like I said, you're just going to uh, brown this up just like you're making tacos. Um, and you can uh, use your favorite taco seasoning or what else. Or get whatever the cheapest. I'm gonna be using just some uh, some store brand or whatever. And then you're just gonna basically follow the recipe on the back, um, for the most part. There will be a few slight differences, but I'll cover them whenever I get there. All right. So once you get this all brown, you're gonna drain it. And so this is where a little bit of a twist is gonna come in. So what I'll do, because I'm making a dip, I will put in the boat, both of the uh, taco seasonings. And then only half of the water that they call for. reason I do that is because I don't want to add too much water to the eight layer dip and then make it real runny. Then turn that off and let it start cooling down. All right, so we've got the uh, ground meat cooled from uh, earlier. Now, to do this recipe, you're gonna start out with two cans of uh, refried beans. You're going to take them refried beans and spread them out across the bottom of your pan.
And then after you refried beans, get your hamburger meat. Smooth that all nice and smooth out over the top of that. Then you got your taco blend cheese. I'm gonna do a thin layer of it. After your cheese, you get 16 ounce container of guacamole. I think this is 16 ounces. Now after the guacamole, it gets a 16 ounce container of sour cream. After your sour cream, you get some shredded lettuce. Then your tomatoes.
then your black olives. There's still a couple pieces in there. I don't know that I need them though. Then I'm going to put a little bit of this jalapeno seasoning over top of it. You can skip this step. Or you can really skip any step you want to. If you don't like guacamole, you don't have to put it in there. If you don't like the um, tomatoes, you don't have to put it in there. And there you have it, a finished eight layer dip. And for this eight layer dip, you can just use any of your favorite uh, tortilla chips or anything like that. Um, I just got the cheap ones. So that's what we're using tonight.